Good morning, Monday 30th of April. This is the town of Seljuch, where we spent yesterday evening. The hotel up there. Just got a little bit of sightseeing to do this morning. This area is supposed to be the the biggest tourist attraction in the whole of Turkey. They'll be off to the ancient city of Ephesus. Um, which is actually uh, probably the most important archaeological site in Turkey. So we're going to have a look at that now before we uh, before we start riding to a town called Aden, where we're going to stay in a warm shower. So let's go and have a look at uh, Ephesus. This is the ancient Greek city of Ephesus. Now the most important tourist attraction in Turkey. It used to be an important trading city in the ancient times. This is the main marble street here that leads down to the library of Celsus. You can see down in the bottom, it's a Roman library. But, uh, we'll go and have a look at that. And Ephesus is also the home of one of the birthplace of uh, Christianity as well. Where our hotel was this morning, that was close to the Basilica of St. John, who lived there for seven years. So this site is about three kilometers away from Selçuk, where we stayed in the hotel. So this is the uh, Library of Celsus, built in 117 AD. Most beautiful structure here in Ephesus. It's an ancient library, it used to house uh, 12,000 scrolls. It was uh, stored between double walls to keep them cool from the, the hot temperatures. Amazing, beautiful building. Julius Celsus, he's, uh, his tomb is below the, the first floor here. He used to be the governor of the whole of Asia. Yeah, there's another ancient theatre, like what we saw in Epidavros. There's another one here. Let's go and have a look. Yes, this is an ancient Greek theatre here, built by the Greeks, exactly the same building style as the one we saw in Epidavros. This is the ancient theatre of Ephesus, which was built in the 3rd century BC. Really impressive site, mainly because uh, the library here has actually been reconstructed. It has was actually destroyed by an earthquake, but they rebuilt it. So, uh, otherwise, it would just be rubble on the ground, like you see, and wouldn't be able to appreciate what it used to look like. But, uh, yeah, amazing place to visit. So that was a quick visit to Ephesus. You probably spend the whole day there if you're taking everything in. But, uh, only had an hour and a half. I have to get on the bikes again to Aiden, where we have a made an agreement with a person from Warden Showers so that we can stay with them this evening. So about 50 kilometers to do an hour to Aiden this afternoon. A bit hilly at first, but then flat afterwards. So let's have a ride on the bikes again. The 
And still you can see to our right, this is the site of uh, where the Virgin Mary was taken after the death of Jesus. She was taken uh, here. She wanted to be in a nice quiet place. Instead of living in the big city of Ephesus, she stayed here on the mountain top. It's a religious site. Start the day with the climb. Already hot already today. Oh. Get through some water in this heat. Hot day today, right, Jamie? Yeah. Not often we see the sweat pouring out of Jamie. <laughs> we have just started the biking and we are soaked in sweat. Actually, I'm sweating so much. See, I can have water on my hands. Biking with two extremely good mountain climbers now. Jamie and Meta. Really. So this looks like a McDonald's turkey style. Turkey here, McDonald's. We have nan bread. Um, me and my dad love uh, Indian food. Indian food, man. Uh, we eat nan bread, and here in Turkey they give you big nan bread, really big. Mm. And there's uh, birds behind us. <laughs> birds. And some kind of milk that we're going to get now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. We try this. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Got loads of kebabs and salad and tomatoes, cheese and all kinds of things here. Onions. And this is a nugget with water mixed in, quite refreshing actually. So, yeah, not bad lunch for us. Yeah, the next section this afternoon is pretty much flat. In the valley now, so we can have a tailwind. So Nice and easy really, 30 kilometers until we get to AD. I've been writing to a guy yesterday from warm showers and we can stay with him this evening in a place called Aden. I'll be the second time we use warm shower, so we'll see what that's like. Oh, this is the centre of Aiden. Quite sure where that building is behind us yet. Yeah. Okay, this is the loudest evening call to prayer we've late afternoon we've heard so far Staying tonight. It's a warm showers place. Patia, I think his name is. Yeah. We just met him in the shop and then he brought us up to his place here. We can go in the shower here and we can uh, go back to his shop and have something to eat with him. He wants us to eat in his shop, so we'll try that. That'll be a new thing, won't to see what that's like. And this is the shop here. Our host from warm showers is working, so we can have he showed us where he lives, where we can sleep tonight, and now we're just gonna invite us to have lunch with him in his shop. So we'll try that. I've never tried that before. <laughs> and now we're here in Patsy's shop. This is a new experience, never tried before. A yeah, nice kind man had to stay or well, eat here with him in his shop. Let's see what that ha what happens. Yeah. Hello. Hi. <laughs> so this is the dinner today in a shop. I haven't I tried that before. I can. <laughs> yes. 
kameraman. Kim? Ben mi Fatih. Tabii. <gülüyor> Fatih has made this food here or his mother has made this food so now we're sitting in the shop. <gülüyor> At the same time, he's serving customers. <laughs> so, some soup and some potatoes. <laughs> now there's even more food. <laughs> Jim's got a new fan. <laughs> Want a picture with him? Yes. <laughs> The kindness of these people is just amazing. Now we just sit here. Yeah, they just turn up with tea and friends appear from everywhere and customers say hello. And <laughs> amazing. Okay, we're back in the uh, uh, warm shows host Fatty's apartment here. He um, he asked us if we would have dinner with him, so uh, yeah, of course we said yes to that. But, uh, that was in the back of his shop, so we sat behind the counter there with uh, his assistant and and his mom had made food for us. So amazing! What you experience with this warm show is the uh, Kindness of people once again is just uh, unbelievable. So uh, we sat there, and in the end, some other friends came in, and uh, other people we don't know came in. Everybody seems to know him, and then another lady came in, a customer wanted to cuddle with Jamie, and <laughs> say good cheeks. <laughs> likes his soft cheeks. Yeah, everybody likes Jamie's soft cheeks. That's also what Fatih said that most he knows most of the customers. Of course, the same customers who come every day, but it was also very, very South European, Middle East kind of ways where people just come into the shop and mm. talk and just nice. It's a really nice place. Friendly yeah. atmosphere. So yeah, good experience. Good we didn't go to a restaurant because you would never get that experience. So. No. So. so we just sat there behind the counter yeah. watching people come in and talking to Fatty whenever he had time, and uh, then they gave us tea, and then another girl that was sitting there. Give me a gave Jamie chocolates and brownie. <laughs> so Chocolate. already after what three days in Turkey now, some of this hospitality we heard about is actually real. <laughs> Turkish people are really friendly. Mm -hmm. So um, and so, it's very hot here now. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to sleep with the door open, open, open tonight. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, another great warm showers experience. So yes, so excellent, yeah. excellent. So I will recommend to not be on a hotel sometimes it's rainy and you want to be on a hotel it's better to go to a warm shower it's need it's actually the same when more more you more interesting more interesting yeah. so good good experience so extremely good experience yeah. uh, but will go on a warm shower not a hotel <laughs> You have a big experience yeah. and really kind people. Mm. Yeah, so so okay. kind. Yes. Also, a warm showers in the next town we're going to go to. So, we'll try and write to him, see if we can stay there tomorrow. <laughs> so, um, so, that was it. That was the end of today. Yeah, we're staying here tonight. We're moving on again tomorrow. Jamie's tired now, I think. Enough experiences for one day with the old city of Ephesus and biking a little bit in the afternoon. And Having dinner with one our new friend Fatty. So yeah, and this is our new mattress. Yeah, and they actually excellent job because the mattresses stay up for a whole night now. So yeah. these are the new ones we got replaced from. Good. So that's good. Okay, that was the end of today. We'll be back tomorrow with oh. another day of adventure. Yes. So good night. Good, good night. night.